Uh, good morning, BNGO investors and everybody else in the investment world. Uh, I brought you over to my happy place. I'm actually in front of a Home Depot. The market's about to open. I just want to tell you about uh, what I really feel about the markets and why the prices go down and up so much. If you take a look at uh, the Rivian price action, uh, you have people that have really big money that can drive that price up. Uh, is it the right value? No, it's not really the right value. Now let's take a look at BNGO. Is BNGO currently the right value? The stock should be driven down so far? Absolutely not. But the fact of the matter is, the money moves in masses. If we look at Ocugen, right, a company that never even had a product, never even uh, made a product, uh, they are racing up to $18 and now they're down to $760. You know, that stock is going to end up being, you know, $2 at the most, maybe $1.50. But what you should really look at is uh, how is BNGO trading? You have these big groups of uh, gangs, right, that control so much money that uh, you want to actually uh, be aware that if they were to push it in one direction, it's going in that direction. If you want to, you know, re uh, retain or, or gain, regain your investment, you better just wait because if you don't wait. Uh, you're going to see this stock, same stock, skyrocketing later when they decide to shift the gears. Now, I watched Ocugen. It's a really good study. So the stock went to 18, then they dropped it down to 8, then they brought it up to 12, then they brought it down to 8. These are not reasonable investors. These are gangs of people that have a lot of money that know exactly how to move the market. And if you get emotional and you don't pay attention to what you own, you're going to end up losing. My opinion on BNGO today is uh, it could end up uh, popping a couple pennies, uh, you know, maybe five, six, maybe even ten cents, but then they're going to drag it down again. And that's going to scare you. That's going to get you emotionally upset. Don't do it. Don't get emotionally upset. Just go along for the ride at this point and hold. Thanks. This is Mark from Newsweed.com. This is not financial advice it's just entertainment some old guy in a home depot parking lot that's talking about an investment that he made uh, that made him a lot of money and uh, who knows where we're gonna go have a great day god bless and don't forget to pray for kathy wood why because she's in favor of doing the right thing for humanity thanks bye